Hello friends and welcome to the sewing swan. How hard it is to find some fancy, beautiful hand towels or tea towels at reasonable price. I found this hard. They are ridiculously expensive. Once you have plain towels and some embellishment, you can do this in no time and really much far cheaper. Let's see how to do this. If you haven't subscribed yet to the Sewing Swan, please do because ideas are getting better and better in our channel. These are just great for gifts, last minute gifts and yet unique and beautiful ones. Get some plain towels of your choice. Some fabric. Embellishments that you like to add. It's very good to have some of these always. If you don't have something in mind now, they will be useful later. So it's good to collect these things in moderation. I'm using pom-poms, the little ones. I might add some tiny ones. This is 100% cotton embellishment. So you need to wash it before use. Also for the towels to avoid shrinkage. You will need some pins, scissors and your sewing machine and if you have a walk-in foot but this is not necessary. For the fabric version cut your fabric one inch more than the width you want on your towel. So I'm, I want four and a half inches uh, uh, width of the fabric I cut five and a half inches of fabric by the width of your fabric plus two inches so you add two inches to the width of your fabric and one inch to the length of it for example my, my towel measures 14 in the width so I cut the piece of fabric 16 inches to have an excess inch on each side. Fold your fabric by half an inch to the back of the fabric and give it a good press from both sides. Do the same to the sides of the fabric piece and press it fold by half an inch on both sides. Now you can place it on your towel. Click on your towel right before the hem to avoid sewing on the bulk of the hem of the towel. Pin in place. Flip your towel. and fold the edges right on the hem of the towel. Let me show you how. This is the side end. Fold it once and fold it twice to cover the hem. So you sew it and you, you get with a clean finishing. Pin in place. The fold of the side of the fabric matches the, um, the size of the hem for a good looking finishing. This way. Now believe it or not, if you sew all around the piece of fabric, you will be finished. So go ahead and sew all around. with a quarter of an inch seam allowance. And there you go. John, cut uh, your pom-pom tape on the one inch bigger or longer than the width of your towel. Place the pom-pom at the edge of your towel 
to stop right before the hem fold both sides with only a quarter of an inch inside from both sides pin in place and sew all over this tape go slow and again you're done this can't get any as easier honestly for virgin we will be using this beautiful cotton embellishment on our towel cut it two inches more of the width of your towel press the top of the tape fold it give it a good press so when we sew it it lays down secured and finished there we go I zigzag finished the uh, the edges and now fold it a quarter of an inch and then fold it to meet the seam of the towel pin in place do this for both sides and then you sew all in one seam and let me remind and let me remind on the fold of the cotton tape right above the hem of the towel so we avoid sewing on the bulk of the hem and there you go that was so easy and there you go easy beautiful unique gifts of your own for yourself or for your friends to gift please subscribe to the sewing swan give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends so you share creativity and and with some beautiful handy affordable ideas